Coin Toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. Franz takes it to 15. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. You know, Herbie, for an offensive coordinator, he's got to love this kid. Whitaker's decision-making abilities make him very effective against any defense he's ever played, really. Well, defenses have to put pressure on him and not let him get comfortable. If you allow him to scan the field, he'll simply pick you apart. If you can disrupt his rhythm, it'll give you a chance at least shutting him down. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And he's tackled at the 38-yard line. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. But they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. From their own 38-yard line, it's second down. He's at midfield. Tackle around the 46-yard line. So he keeps it, and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. And now he's got room to run. They'll bring him down at the 31-yard line. That makes it first and 10. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 31-yard line. Nice run up the middle. Gain of six yards. That brings him second and five. The 14. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. From the 14-yard line, first down. He's tackled at the 16-yard line. The defense was able to get really good penetration and drop him short of the line of scrimmage. That brings up second and 13. It's third down, 12 to go. Ball on the 16-yard line. There's a strike complete. He's down. Gaddis picks up about five yards on that hookup. This will make it a field goal game. The kick is up, and it's good. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. Nolan looks ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 29. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Three down, three down. Now here's the line, here's the line. Third, two. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That makes it second and six. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 33. Quick throw out to the receiver. He's taken down at about the 45. Besides going deep on the fade, the slant route is probably the most commonly run route against man coverage. If the receiver gets a good inside release, it'll be a new set of downs every time. Up the middle for a nice game. That'll bring up second and three. 
They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Here's a running play. And he's taken down at the 38. Make the stop at the 37. That brings up second and nine. From the 37 yard line, second down. Good protection, throw in left. And he got it to the sophomore. Got an opening. First and goal coming up. He's knocked down after a big game. And that's the way you're supposed to play pitch and catch. Absolutely. You know, this wide receiver is a difference maker. He's one of those players that has a chance to go the distance every time you get him the ball. So now it's first and goal after the big pass play. And he tacks on the extra point. It was a seven play, 71 yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. The score now, 7 3. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Franz takes it to 14. They'll bring him down at the 25. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Gonna lose yards here. And they back up three yards on that play. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. From their own 22 yard line. Second down. Here's a screen pass. Gets it to the back. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Loss of five there. But that play was sort of out of sync from the start, but you have to also recognize that the defense made a great play. They read it from the get-go. Good tackle in space. First down. So let's see how the defense responds now. It's first down and ten. He makes it to the 35-yard line. Not a lot of offense in quarter number one, but nonetheless, we've got a close game. 7-3, Hurricane. And we welcome you back to the action here, and we have got a tight one going on in quarter number two. Keeper. Well played there by the defensive tackle. He didn't over pursue the play and made a nice stop. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 26. Brought down at the 24. That's good for a game of 11 yards. First down. All right, guys, that's tight. Four down, four down. Mike, four. Hot, hot, 
Makes it to the 22-yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. They run left, and he'll lose yardage. They line up for another third down, and they've had no problem converting their first two. and he can't pull it in. That would have been pretty remarkable if he'd managed to hold on to the ball after taking a shot like that. Kicks up, and it splits the uprights. Looks like they're ready for the kicker. He'll return it from the one. Across the 30. The 50. He goes down at the 36. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. They're about four yards away here on second down. And down he goes at the 27. Inside the 10. Knocked out of bounds at the six-yard line. That makes it first and goal. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. He's tackled at the four. That's a game That brings up second and goal. Tackle at the one. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. That was the junior linebacker who'll get credit with the tackle there. Third and goal. About a yard to Pater. I like the scheme the defensive coordinator came up with here. They were all over the place on that play and left the quarterback nowhere to throw it. They're trying to stop the run here with a goal line defense. Setting up the play action. Steps out of bounds around the one-yard line. So they turn it over on downs, and that's a big boost for this defense. In a close game like this one, it's big plays like this that can be the deciding factor. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Lumpkin gets six yards on the carry. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Going deep. The defender had it and then dropped it. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads-up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Well, that's a great job by this offense. The defense knew that the run was coming, and they still could not slow them down. Pick up a first down and allows him to continue to work this clock. He's on the run. And he has 
a huge game. Yeah, and I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off. Ends up with a great run. There's a strike complete. Olsen picks him up around seven yards with that catch. Seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. The Bears are going to call their second timeout. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Scrambling around. They'll bring him down right around the 42-yard line. That's a game seven. First down. He steps up at the 48. Gain of six yards. That'll bring up second and three. This is the eighth play of this drive. Complete, brought down, nothing doing. Looks like they've decided to go for it here. He gets to about the 41-yard line. So both teams will go to the locker room looking to make some adjustments and find some second-half offense. The Hurricanes in front, 7-6. Glad to have you with us in the studio for the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Reese Davis and David Pollock here completely locked in on that first half. Defense has been in total control in the first half, and you'd think maybe the offense's confidence was shaken. But if you want to look at the entire team picture, David, how big a deal is it for an offense to know, look, if we can just put together one, maybe two good scoring drives, our defense has got our back. Well, a lot of times when you know you have a defense, it's great, too, is you build your offense around it. And when I say that, why do I need to take chances? You know, if it's third and long, I don't mind throwing a five-yard pass, and if I break a tackle, I get a first down. I mean, don't put my defense that's dominant, that's great, in a bad position, and, and you can afford to be more conservative. You see it every single year. What do we always talk about here at ESPN? We talk about you, you defense wins championships, and that's how you win ball games, and you see it consistently unfold. So if I'm building an offense, Let's just not put my great dominant defense in a bad position. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. It's going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Double tight, double tight. Three down, three down. 18, 18, 18, 18. Makes it to the 44. their own 44-yard line. First down. Nice run to the left there. it up. And that one's recovered.
covered by the cornerback. Funny, because you usually don't see corners down there picking up loose balls. They're more worried about interceptions. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. The halfback with a carry. He's pushed out of bounds around the 49-yard line. From the 49-yard line, it's second down. He's at the 40. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. I like how efficient the offense looked on that play. Everybody knew their assignment, and it all came together for a nice run. He scrambled. Now he's going to run and watch out. He's tackled at the 24-yard line. From the 24-yard line. It's first down. He might have a chance. Tackle made at the 15-yard line. That's good for gaining nine yards. That brings up second and one. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Mike four. He's scrambling. And they got him. You have to keep an eye on this guy, especially during passing situations, because he does a great job of getting to the quarterback, as we saw right there. They're about four yards away here on third down. Looks middle, got his back. Lost the ball. Scooped up by the defense. So the offense turns over the pigskin. The ball carrier here was just careless in handling the ball. And a great awareness by the defense to jump on. This offense was infected by the turnover bug their last time out. Let's see if they can hold on to the ball here. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. You don't make changes after one play. They hand it off. He's taken down at the 19-yard line. Gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. From their own 19-yard line, it's second down. Moves up in the pocket. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked off. Number 32, the intended receiver on the play. That'll bring up third and eight. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And he's taken down at the 22. We've got a change at the quarterback position. You gotta wonder how that's gonna affect this offense. I would think the offensive coordinator and the head coach are just gonna try to ease him into this game at the beginning. McCarthy is the deep man awaiting the return. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. McCarthy takes it at the 33, and down he goes at the 46. Everywhere we go in college football, everybody's got a T-shirt that says finish, finish, whether that means finish the game or finish the drive. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. they got to execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. He gets out to about the 48-yard line. That makes it second and eight. It's second and eight. Ball on the 48. And they make the stop at about the 49. The halfback carries for a pickup of three. This junior corner has been progressively improving his run defense. He's better at diagnosing those plays now, and he knows how to bring a guy down. He 
He's scrambling. Brought down at the 40-yard line. Gain of nine yards. First down. From the 40-yard line. First down. Makes it out to about the 29. Call it a gain of 11 yards. That makes it first and 10. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And down he goes at the 15. Number 24 on the tackle at the 15 yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 15 yard line. Based on their last visit to the red zone, I'd expect them to take better care of the ball this time around. Gets his running back, and it's knocked down. Brad, I love the way the defense is flying around right now and hitting people. This looked like an easy catch for the running back out of the backfield, but a big hit right here can really start to create some energy for the defense. He's got an opening, and they're in. Touchdown. quarterback just showed us he can beat you with his feet as well as his arm. And what a dangerous weapon this guy is. They'll go for two in this situation. They don't get it. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He'll return it from the four-yard line. At the 30. And he's taken down at the 38. The Bears continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. It's second and ten. Ball on the 38. Nice run there. That's three down and one to go. The Bears lead is five. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Three down, three down. Mike, eight. Mike, eight. Three and eight. He makes his way to about the 45. From the 45 yard line, first down. Again with a carry. Gets to about the 44-yard line. That brings up second and nine. Double tight, guys. Double tight. Three down, three down. Hey, number eight's coming. Number eight's Mike. Mike. Mike eight, Mike eight. Yellow seven. He gets out to about the 42-yard line. Nice play. two yards. That makes it third and seven. And here's another third down. throw incomplete one of his receiver he tried to hit his receiver in stride but overthrew it a little too much that'll come in time just repetition throwing that same pass over and over and he'll be fine five wide I got number 18. Caught it and tackled he didn't make it 
A score here might effectively end this one. I think it's safe to say the defense had his number on that one. It can be very frustrating for a running back when he stopped before he even gets going. It's second down, 12 to go. Ball on their own 38. Gets it off as he's hit, complete. And he's tackled at the 31-yard line. by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. Nolan is the punter. Tackle at the 36. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game. But the offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead. Tackle after decent pickup. Second down and five. Ball on their own 41. He heaves it deep. Brought down with only one man to beat. Now it's first and ten after the big pass play. Just under three to go in regulation. at the 18-yard line. That brings up second and nine. And he's tackled after positive yardage. Gaining four yards. Third down. It's third and five. Ball on the 14. Gets it to the back, and he's shoved out of bounds at about the 13. That makes it fourth and four. He flings it. It's always a gamble going for it with so many yards to come up with. But when you're behind, sometimes you have to take risks to get back into a ball game. A conversion there could have really helped him, but it just wasn't to be. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Here's the give. They'll bring him down at the 13. Sometimes a play is not going to work for whatever reason. Doesn't mean you throw the play away. You just need to execute better next time. He makes his way to about the 22. The offensive line got a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. He's out to the 30. He goes out of bounds. Right around the 32-yard line. First down. Just under two to go in the game. Makes it to the 47. 
You know, the defense knew that this offense was trying to work the clock. When you want to work the clock, you're going to run the football. It puts a lot of pressure on the offensive line to get low and drive that defensive line back. And that's what they were able to do there to give the running back enough room to pick up that first down. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own 49. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's good for a game of five yards. That makes it third and three. They get nice yardage on that run. Good for a gain of six yards. Here's the eighth play of the series. So this one goes final. A hard fought close game. 12 7. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.